think it's a big, um, a big part of it how both teams are defending uh, each team. Uh, neither team played like this during the regular season. <laughs> um, and it's just coming down to that, how, how many plays you can make during the course of the game, how efficient you can be uh, with, with your offense, even if you're not scoring big. Uh, and then uh, inevitably it comes down to those final possessions going down the stretch. Uh, even though uh, we played so poorly in the first half, uh, you just had a feeling that uh, the game was going to come down to a, a possession game down the stretch. It did. Uh, and they made more plays. Uh, you know, they, uh, they got some extra possessions offensively and then um, got to the line and, and they made some big shots uh, down the stretch. Uh, and we weren't able to to get over that hump. We felt like we were going to be able to once we got it to one. Um, then we fouled DeRozan um, on, a, on a, a broken play. It looked like it might have been uh, a loose ball situation. We might have been able to, uh, to, to take care of that, but we uh, weren't able to. Um, you know, I don't know. I don't know if the offense is going to trend uh, better for either team right now. Uh, they're uh, two highly competitive teams, uh, well scouted. Uh, just have to find uh, different ways, uh, you know, to find a way to get over the over the top. And um, you know, we really felt like we were going to be able to get the job done, and we didn't. And uh, you have to give them credit. Eric, you've been saying all series that you could, you would anticipate Lowry and or DeRozan kind of playing like Lowry and DeRozan at some point. What did you see in their games today? Was it something? Was it just kind of the inevitable? Or no, not necessarily. Involved? I mean, you have to credit them. So, look, they're they're all stars. Uh, you have to uh, embrace and, and take the challenge on, on good players in this league in the playoffs. Um, and they're a very good team. Uh, so even with all that said, you still have opportunities to win. Uh, even with big nights, uh, if we just get one or two more stops and a little bit more efficient offensively down the stretch, uh, you know, we can come out of here with a win. Um, but I think early on, uh, some of the lack of discipline in terms of allowing them to get some rhythm shots, rhythm free throws early on that first quarter. That's a dangerous thing with All-Stars, and they see the ball going through that net uh, from the free throw stripe. Um, now they get a little bit more confident in, in other areas. Coach, were you surprised at all that they, they stayed big, basically, no, for most of the game? No, we anticipated uh, uh, that. And actually, the way this series is going, <laughs> can't be surprised by anything. Um, where do you where does that present a bigger challenge for you when you're playing small versus versus their big? Well, you, you saw it. It's uh, uh, the blockouts. Um, you know, we're, we're putting bodies on them. We're getting uh, you know thrown around, and uh, they're able to get some extra important extra possessions. Um, but we had some advantage in the other way. So, uh, you know, that's that's the give and take of it. Uh, tonight, they're able to, to to take advantage of that. Coach, can you provide any update on Luol Deng's status, and can you just sort of comment on how difficult it is for you to, to manage losing, you've been losing guys continually? Whatever it takes. We have enough. Um, more than anything, you just, you're, you're concerned for Lou. Um, you know, you got an x-ray right now. When we get to Miami, we'll, we'll get an MRI. Um, Lou's about as tough a competitor as I've ever been around, um, so we'll see. Uh, uh, but the fact that he wasn't there in, this, in the second half, um, you know, we'll, we'll see. I don't, I don't even want to jump to a conclusion right now. Um, but look, he was out. Uh, Hassan's out. Uh, whatever it takes. We're still there in a possession game. We got it to one. So we have enough. We have uh, guys that are confident uh, in the team and the ability to get the job done. And, uh, you know, now it's about just getting, getting ready for a, a big game, game six uh, at home. Our guys love this. Our guys love this uh, type of competition.